obviously the Bible teaches about the 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 the, th the three spheres of of government the home the church and the government civil civil authorities Romans 13 mm -hmm. um Ephesians 5 uh, uh, children obey your parents in the Lord um fathers do not provoke your children raise them up in the instruction and admonition of the Lord um family worship we were just talking about that at our Bible study uh, we had a question and answer um, on uh, yesterday, uh, on Wednesday rather, and we we're talking about the importance of family worship. Family worship is not to just sit down so you can say you've you've gathered the family. No, it is it is a blessing that God intended for the home, mm -hmm. for the society, because when you raise children up to love God and love their neighbor, and to respect authority. Uh, and to and to treat people with respect and love, um, then then you you send those children out into the society to affect the society in a in a in a good way in a mm -hmm. way that benefits everyone, mm -hmm. and then they don't get to the government side or they don't have the dealings and the interactions with the government because obviously they have been raised to love God and their neighbor and to treat people with a respect that they were born and made in the image of God, and so you don't have to you you won't get to that from that family sphere and get entangled with the government sphere and the government won't have to use the sword as much because the family has done what they were supposed to do mm -hmm. you know just to, to invest and spend time with and sit down with their their family and teach them the way of the lord mm -hmm. and so um yeah I, I think absolutely it starts with the family and it's it's, it's something that we can not neglect I think uh, if there's and I encourage everyone that, that listens that if you're a father, if you're a husband and if you don't sit down with your wife and your your children and do what you do in the Lord's Day worship with just reading, singing, mm -hmm. hearing the word read. Those, and, and those are some of the regular rhythms that we are need to that we need to be in daily. Yep. So, again, it starts there. It starts there and you can see the disconnect where, especially in this in, in the city where there are varied circumstances and that family structure, that family structure is splintered. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, you have in some instances, children not living with their mom or dad. They might be living with their grandparent mm -hmm. for whatever reason. And, and it is tough. Mm -hmm. It's hard. It's hard to have a grandmother raise children. Uh, th that to 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 do the and do the job of of a parent or over of a mother and a father, and so you'd certainly take those things into consideration. But it it absolutely doesn't negate the fact that it must be done.